morning everybody welcome back so today me and jasper we've woke up we're getting ready at the moment we're just kind of like packing off our last couple of bits of stuff because we are heading off to brighton today which is so exciting. well we're actually not heading to brighton we're heading just outside of brighton to a place called worthen our plan was to spend the whole weekend in brighton but we found this really nice airbnb just outside of brighton so we decided that we we're gonna go for the nice airbnb and just go slightly outside of brighton it's kind of like a half an hour drive into brighton i think worthen is so it's not too bad um and i think it's worth it for the airbnb i cannot wait to show you when we get there but we've got two nights there so we're going tonight we're spending all day tomorrow in brighton and then we're coming home the day after so it should be a really nice weekend so we're just packing up the last couple of bits and then we should head off it's about a two hour drive to worthing so we're gonna head off soon we can check into the airbnb at about one o'clock i think it is so we should we're aiming to kind of get there around like half one two ish so i need to finish packing up my stuff and then we're gonna head out i'm so excited i feel like we haven't done anything i've actually i don't think i've ever stayed in an airbnb I've always like, looked at them, but we end up just like picking a hotel. So this will be a good experience as well, just to see what an Airbnb is like. This is the current packing situation. We're almost there. I've got a mini suitcase, which I feel like is a bit OTT for a weekend, but is it? It's two nights, so I usually take a mini suitcase. So just packing everything up now. Right guys, we're in the car, just about to head off. Jasper's just about to get the last few. Oh, I got the hiccups, it's so annoying. Um, Just about to get the last few bits and then we should go. So I really want to get a Starbucks as well. I really fancy like an iced coffee. <sighs> I feel like another hiccup's coming. I was saying I really fancy a Starbucks and an iced coffee. No? <laughs> so we're just pulling up to Starbucks. I've convinced Jasper that we need to get Starbucks on the way. It's not that bad. It's not as bad as I thought. Should you go for the drive through Yeah. Yeah, may as well. I mean, if somebody lets me across, it'd be nice, wouldn't it? <laughs> Road rage? I'm just holding up everybody. Yeah. Nobody wants to let me in. I'm so happy that it's sunny. Like, it just makes me so happy. Yeah, right. boy. What are you gonna get? Iced. Iced ah. caramel mac. I don't like those. What, an iced caramel mac? No, the, those sort of cars. You always really like them, don't you? They're like- uh, I wouldn't ever want one. Old school. Anyway, I'm getting iced caramel macchiato, blonde roast, soy milk. You? Probably the same, but with regular milk. You should, Vibes. Try, you should try it with soy milk. Cut down on the right. dairy. Soy milk's horrible. No, it's not. No, it's not. <laughs> it isn't like a coffee. Oh, I like it's it. Grim. I feel like the weirdest thing about it is though, whenever I've tried your coffees with like normal milk, like cow's milk, I cannot drink them. Like they, uh, they taste horrible to me now. It's because you're not used to it. No, it? like I haven't drunk like actual milk in like years now oh, you really far from the speaker i didn't realize i had to order that yeah, <laughs> <there, cannot laughs> it's cannot. so embarrassing well starbucks do you have any allergies that we need to be aware of uh no love you what can i get for you can i get a iced caramel macchiato with blonde roast and soya milk please was that a large uh medium please that's it thank you 8.30 out the window, thank you. Cheers. Got the essentials. Is this one soya? Yeah. Yeah, should be. I need to like mix it. Have you mix yours? No. No. So we've just arrived. We're gonna go have a look um, and see if we can get in. I need to get my details off my phone. So we've got here, I think Tilia and Aiden, who are also coming, are getting here in about like two hours. We're here. I think she said about four she was getting here so we're probably gonna head in have a little look at it and then maybe go get go to a shop or something and get some like water and things yeah. mouthwash a couple of things we forgot yeah. so right let's go i just leave stuff in the car for now okay this is it we got the keys right it's <laughs> oh so oh my gosh it's so nice whoa so we have just arrived i want to give you a little tour so as you walk into the house there is this living room which is absolutely stunning it's so nice love the prints i've got that print at home <laughs> look how nice it all is got some nice bookshelves by the side then we've got a tv with like this like wood burner and then some more shelves it's so nice and then coming out of here We've got this massive open plan living area. Like, how nice is this? Got a dartboard up there. And then it's really just like light and like airy. 
the kitchen is so nice let me go over here to show you look how nice the kitchen is i love this island like it's actually beautiful and then this is actually i'm pretty sure is a pool table under here for what we could see so that would be fun but it's also like doubles off as like a dining table i love the little skylights so nice and then this is the little garden area it actually gets quite a lot of sun yeah it's nice isn't it? yeah we can go upstairs and have a quick look at all the bedrooms so i haven't actually been up here yet it's really dark is there a light there we go what is this room okay so this is room number one this is so cute got a nice mirror here as well and then coming up here oh that's locked so i assume we can't go in there this is so cute this is room number two so nice what's the view like out here oh it's just of the gardens what is in here oh this is the bathroom oh wow this is so nice really i love like a big shower like this this is so cute love this i feel like i literally said everything's cute and then is this locked as well yeah do you like it it's nice so nice Oh my gosh, it's like being back in Egypt <laughs> with the towel sculptures. This is so great. This is so nice though. I'm so happy. I feel like we did good. Yeah, turn the bathroom light off. I feel like we did good picking this one. Tilly, I found this one. We found one in Brighton that was all right, but this is so much nicer. So I'm glad we came a bit further out. I'm so excited to be here. Jas was just uncovering the pool table. I don't know. I feel like we need to actually like read the instructions. This is so cool. I'm actually obsessed. Like I actually can't believe this turns into a pool table. I mean, I'm absolutely terrible at pool. So I don't know why I'm so excited about this, but. <laughs> so we're gonna go try and find some food because we haven't eaten anything yet today. So I'm absolutely starving. Um, and then we're also gonna go find a shop as well. So let's head out. Such a cute Airbnb though, isn't it? Just having a little walk around the town. Where should we go for food? I don't know, what sort of food do you feel? I don't know. Or like proper sit down meal? No, it's like snacks. We're in a little, what do you call it, restaurant? Cocktail bar? Yeah. It's very busy around here though, isn't it? Bank Royal, isn't it? Yeah. Nice that's study. True. This soft food, I have no idea what that is. Fritz on salad. Sausage and some chips. Yeah. Just got our cocktails. Look how nice they look. I mean, we did have to wait half an hour for them, but worth it. <laughs> Fruity, innit? Let's come to the beach. Have a little look. A little pier over there. It's a bit cold. It's a bit like windy. Yeah, the wind's a little bit chilly. Yeah, but we're gonna walk back now. Cocktails are really nice. Very nice. Very nice. And food is nice as well. So we're back at the Airbnb and Jasper has decided that he's going to play a game of pool by himself. <laughs> Best thing I've ever seen. Oh. I feel like we should definitely take advantage of the sun in the garden tomorrow, but I just don't think we will. It's probably being bright in most of the day tomorrow. This is just honestly the coolest thing to have in an Airbnb, isn't it? It's like a pretty decent table as well, isn't it? Yeah, I thought it was just going to be like a pop-up. Yeah. Oh, that was pretty good. Precision. <laughs> Tilly and Ada should be here soon. So it's actually quite nice to have a little walk around, wasn't it? Just like a walk around the town centre. Because um, I don't think, like, tomorrow we're going into Brighton, so we're not going to spend much time here at all. So it's a bit later on, and I'm just currently curling my hair because we're going out at, like, I think it's 7. I don't know what the time is now. We've got, like, 40 minutes. So we're going to this, like, Italian restaurant. So it should be really nice. I'm excited. I'm excited for some Italian food. Hopefully get some pasta. Because I absolutely love pasta. I feel like one of my all-time favourite meals is spaghetti. Right, I've just finished cutting my hair. This is my outfit I've gone for. Um, the huge purple top, black like little. These are like, I think they're like straight leg trousers. They're from like PRT anyway. Um, but yeah, this is the outfit. We've got like 20 minutes, so it's only like a 10 minute walk from where we are. Jasper's currently trying to navigate us to the restaurant, but he's not having much luck, I don't think. You know what it's called? Mangiamo. Mangiamo. Tiller and Aiden are here. Now the next 
next day and we're just getting ready to go into Brighton today which is good I'm currently doing my hair and everything hence why I look a little bit crazy but yeah I'm feeling so tired this morning <laughs> are you tired I'm you feel all right you feel all right I feel so tired I need to like have an iced coffee or something to wake me up quarter to nine leaving in like 15 minutes I need to finish my makeup get dressed all that good stuff but I'm so excited to go into Brighton today and it looks like such a nice day like the sun's out at the moment are you excited yeah it's really good we don't really have much of a plan the only thing we have planned is breakfast um, well like brunch so yeah that should be really nice I'm so excited for that I can't wait to see what the menu I had a brief look at the menu of the place we're going and it looked really nice but we'll see so this is my outfit of the day I've got this these shorts on this little crop top and then this oh your shirt so hopefully i'll be warm it's quite sunny outside so hopefully it stays that way and i won't be cold but we'll see but yeah this is my outfit i'm going for good morning Ann. <laughs> oh it's so nice here isn't it right it's like got the nicest yeah sunlight coming in the windows i'm telling you that there ain't no other way pack your bags and then you will go away i'm not gonna be begging you to stay and maybe if you asked me yesterday, I would handle this differently. Things are different, I'm a new me. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. That's not, that's not gonna happen. So even if you're asking, even, even if you're asking. So we just had brunch. Now we're having a little wander. So we're going to the marina, which should be nice. Hopefully. We drove past it, didn't we? And it was like, had real nice apartments and stuff. Yeah. I think I've been to the marina before with my sister. But we just had a walk around the lanes, which was nice. Went into like a cute little shop. But brunch was so nice, wasn't it? Yeah, it was very nice. You had this like, what was it called? Uh, I can't remember. It was like some breakfast bun thing. And I had avocado on toast with poached egg. So good, so. It's a bit chilly today though. A little bit cold for my liking. In the sun, it's not hard. Right. Yeah, like in the sun, it's like nice and warm. But when you go in the shade, it's like a little bit windy and breezy. So I feel like I'm not dressed for the, for the weather, but... you got a jacket. Yeah, to be fair, you're only in a t-shirt. Yeah, I'll just start doing star jumps then. I actually, I actually love Brighton though. Yeah, it's nice. It's so nice. And they just have so many cute like coffee places, brunch places. That's just my vibe. So the place we're going to, what was it called? Globals. Globals. So we'll see what that's like. But I think they have like indoor mini golf and carnival games. I think we're gonna do carnival games, but we'll see what it's like when we get there. But yeah, I don't know what sort of things they would do. It should just be like a straight line along the seafront to the marina. Yeah. I mean we could get an Uber. Now what? Sunny. <laughs> That is true. It's a two mile walk. Yeah, but two miles ain't that far. Really. Well, we'll see. We'll let you guys know how we get on. So we've had a bit of a change of plan and we've got bikes. Um, I don't know how this is going to go. The last time we rode bikes was in London on the Boris bikes. Are we all ready? Have you got yours now? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah, can't wait. You actually love going on bikes, don't you? Yeah. We're... <laughs> We're all ready. Here we go. We're off. <laughs> playing this game where you have to put the... What is it called? It's like, um... Yeah, it's game. I don't know what it's called, but it's like where you like put the hoop through the metal thing.
We're on our way to a chocolate, it's like a chocolate drink shop. Me and Jasper have been there before and it was so nice. And you pick the percentage of the chocolate that you want. So last time Jasper got a 34% chocolate and he got like an iced chocolate drink and it was so nice. So I think we're gonna get that again, me and Jasper. I don't know what to do and anything gonna get, but we'll see, but it was so nice. There it is, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. It's so good, aren't they? And you got milkshake. It's good. You got the thirty-four percent as well, didn't you? We went to the pier. Now we're gonna go get some food because I'm I'm actually really hungry. Yeah. So we're going to a place called hopefully. Oh, this is it. Is that it? Yeah, we're going to a place called Copper Club. It looks really nice. Look how nice that looks. I've got a strawberry daiquiri. You've got... What were yours called? Can you remember? It's a pina cola mango. Have you tried it? It's a nice. Okay, go on then. <laughs> Oh, let me try mine. It's not as good as a pina colada. Oh yeah, they're all so strong. I don't know why, I just I hate it when someone just tastes tests. You do it all the time, don't you? <laughs> yeah, you hate it when I Okay guys, it's time to do a taste oh. test. <laughs> oh, she was like... It's nice, it's strong, but it's nice. Like, it's subtle like straw. Our food yeah, looks so good, doesn't it? It does look nice. We are now back from Brighton, back at the Airbnb, and I am feeling really tired. To be fair, we've had quite a long day, haven't we? We got to Brighton about 10 o'clock, so we've been there kind of all day. What's the time now? Oh, it's currently like 20 past eight, so it has been quite a long day, actually. But we are back. I just took off my makeup and shoved my hair up, got in comfy clothes, because I feel like that's just the essential thing to do as soon as you get back home. I just can't chill out. Jasper can chill out in jeans. Like, you're literally wearing jean shorts, although you didn't actually bring any other no, comfy clothes or anything. No, so, we're back at the Airbnb anyway. Dinner was actually really nice, wasn't it? Well, it's kind of like lunch slash dinner, because we had brunch and then we had that at like five o'clock. It was so nice. I had this like little chicken thing with some fries, with some like coleslaw -y kind of stuff. Me and Jasper are gonna play a game of okay, pool. Back here as well. Does that mean I'm gonna win? Well, no, I'm just giving you, you can't have any excuses then, can you? Okay, so am I am I doing the thing? Mm -hmm. Okay, you can film it. We'll get the first shot live. All right. So. Well, not live, but. Wait, this is a warm up. No, 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 no. You, you just said you're really good. You got to go straight in. I mean, <laughs> it was okay. Does that mean I get another go? No, you need to pot a ball. Ah, oh. oh, gutted. What was your favourite part of the day? Yeah, that chocolate so, place was so nice. I feel like I loved going to that carnival place and oh, riding yeah. on the bikes. That was I don't know good. Yesterday, I don't know why. <laughs> it feels like a long day, yeah. We're currently packing up our room, putting everything, putting everything in my suitcase, ready to leave because we've got to leave at like 12. So we've got a little bit of time, but we're currently packing everything up. Really nice place. What was it called? 
said obviously was in Worthing, so we went and quickly got breakfast there. And it was so nice. I had this really nice hot chocolate with like a toasted marshmallow on top. Um, you had a really nice iced coffee. Yeah, wow. Nice. And then for breakfast, I had my classic, which is avocado and poached eggs with a little bit of bacon as well, which was really nice. So happy we decided to go and get brunch there because we didn't book anywhere, so it was just luck that they had a table as well, which was really yeah, it's good. One table, wasn't it? One table. So yeah, we were really lucky with that. So that was the end of our weekend in Brighton. So we're now just heading home. We've got about like an hour and a half drive left. We also just had the best time with Tilly and Like they're just like the nicest people ever, and we just like we're saying like we just talk, we just non-stop talk when we're with them. Like we just have so like we just talk about literally anything, don't we? Like they're just so easy to get on with, and it was just the nicest time. So I was so glad we went with them as well. Definitely recommend going on a trip to Brighton if you get the chance because it's just so rich to do that. So many nice places to eat, just so many like cute shops. And I think it's just like a, such a nice place to go for like the weekend. Try and remember to link that Airbnb in the description box because it was just, it was so cheap. Like, well, it wasn't like super cheap, but it was like £200 a night. For like two couples. So for like, yeah, for, for both of us, it only cost us £200 and them £200. So it was really good. So yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed the Brighton vlog. And make sure you give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it because it does really support my channel. And also subscribe to you if it's out on any other videos. And other than that, I hope you guys have a lovely evening and I'll see you all again for another vlog very soon.